What's up everyone, welcome back. The time has come once again for another Splatoon 2 Splatfest. Fuck yeah. And this time we have ourselves a special one because it is not only just your average Splatfest, it is fucking Splatoween. Which is fucking awesome, so... Definitely gonna do a lot of recording of this, and uh, it's gonna be fucking great. We're gonna have ourselves a good time, as always. It's pretty much impossible to play Splatoon and not have a good time, unless you run into snipers. So, hopefully that doesn't happen too much to me today. <laughs> Otherwise, I might have to fucking murder somebody. Anyway, let's get this fucking party started. Yep, 48 hours of this. It's gonna be fucking awesome. Okay, so we got Wahoo World. And the Reef. And of course, Shifty Station. Definitely excited to see what uh, Shifty Station's like this time. Alright. So yeah, we're going to get rocking and rolling here. For Splatoween. It's going to be fucking awesome. So yeah, we're going to get things rolling here. First things first, of course. I have to pick a side. Now, I gotta say, this is actually a pretty tough one for me. See, because on the one hand, I love tricking people because I'm an asshole. But on the other hand, I fucking love candy. So, again, this one's pretty tough, but I'm going to have to go with Treat. Speaking of treats, before I forget, got to grab myself one. Yeah, I remember back in the days of uh, the original Splatoon, sometimes during the Splatfests, I would eat dum-dums, and I happen to have some dum-dums with me today, so... Since I'm on Team Treat, it feels only appropriate. I'm gonna kick things off with a little, uh, sour apple. It's gonna be good. Tasty. You know, I forgot how much I love dum-dums. Some good shit. All right, so gonna be kicking things off here. Sorry if I sound a little weird, but you know I'm kind of sucking on a dum dum. So, all right, so yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and just kick things off with the uh, Clash Blaster, same weapon that I ended with last time, but I just love it so much that you know. The thing I love about the uh, Clash Blaster is that it's just so fucking obnoxious, you know. It's not very powerful, but it actually is pretty decent for killing because, you know, you get a lot of rapid shots off. So, it's obnoxious as hell, and I love it. Yeah, actually, I'm doing this uh, Splatfest in the morning for a change instead of at night when I usually do. Because last night after work, I was just so fucking tired. Work was horrible yesterday, so... I just... Couldn't do it, but that's why I'm back again in the morning to uh, do this. So, yeah, it's going to be fun. All right, here we go. The Reef. Ooh, I like that old-timey thing going on there. Is that going to stay throughout the entire match? Holy shit, it is. Oh, no, wait, no, it isn't. Okay, I was going to say, that'd be interesting. That little old-timey thing that they have going on, that's kind of a neat little touch. I did some matches uh, off uh, that I didn't record with the uh, Clash Blaster and whatnot. You know, just trying out the Clash Blaster a bit more. So I've gotten a little used to it. And uh, I love it. It's fucking awesome. Ah, shit. 
Whatever. Screw it. We're all going after him. Yeah, these are some excellent Halloween colors, though, all joking aside. Love it. This thing is so fucking obnoxious. I actually got somebody. Not bad. Not bad at all. Ah, shit. Didn't even see that. That's alright. There. I'm glad I was able to give that guy a little backup. I feel like we did pretty good. That being said, though, I think they beat us. Just based on the map. Nope, we beat them. Nice. Yeah, that was actually a pretty even match between both teams there. Nice. She broke 900 with the Clash Blaster. It's not bad for coverage. Alright. Kick ass. Well, guys, I'll see you all next time. Peace out.